So, a little emotional earlier. I got I got some people in my life that are going through some things, and it's it's hard, you guys. There's a lot of people out there struggling, and and not just people I know on the channel, but people in my in my life. And people are giving up, man. People are choosing uh, drugs, alcohol, death over life, over light, over spreading the word. The word is hope. The word is life. The word is truth. And that word that we get, that we spread, that hope, the love, compassion, the kindness, the encouragement, we give that in the name of God, in the spirit of God. Because we know that we as humans aren't able to solve all that on our own. So we have to rely on a power greater than us. However that looks in your life, you have to come to terms with um, asking a power greater than you to help you just reaching out okay today is december 20th i love each and every one of you wholeheartedly i can't tell you how much this channel means to me and how much the the, the people that are a part of the channel mean to me because you guys are the channel and you guys are the ones that are are liking and watching so let this carry us through you guys okay december 20th our face should control the whole of our life we alcoholics and addicts were living a divided life we had to find a way to make it whole again when we were drinking, our lives were made up of a lot of scattered and unrelated pieces. We must pick up our lives and put them together again. We do it by recovering faith in a divine principle in the universe that holds us together and holds the whole universe together. And it gives it meaning and purpose. We surrender our disorganized lives to that power. We get into great harmony with this divine spirit. And our lives are made whole again. The meditation for today, avoid fear as you would a plague. Even the smallest amount of fear hacks at the cords of faith that bind you to God. However small the fraying, in the times those cords will wear thin, and then one disappointment or shock will make them snap. But for the little fears, the cords of faith would have had held firm. Amen. Remember that fear can be a lack of trust in God. It is a denial of his care and protection. So today we pray that I may have the such trust in God today that I will not fear anything too greatly. And I pray that I may have assurance that God will take care of me in the long run. I'm praying and thinking about all the people out there that are struggling uh, and that are still sick and suffering with this disease, illness of alcoholism, a drug addiction. And I'm praying hard for you guys. And I'm here as a brother to stand in the gap for you and for me, for him. God bless you.